Hey guys, we're gonna do a simple neck um, movement. So this is like a precursor to your cars, your regular neck cars. And this is just a rot rotation of the neck with a bit of retraction. So it restricts the motion, so you won't go as far as you normally would without the retraction or chin tucking. But what we get is it pushes it into the back of the neck and the upper back. So if you sit tall, if this is really hard for you guys to sit tall, if your neck is that bad, lay down on your back and have support of the ground and do the exact same thing. So what I want you to do is I want you to tuck the chin straight back or make your chin go straight back. Makes you have a bit of a double chin. And then we're going to hold that tension about 20% and rotate as far as we can to the right and as far as we can to the left. What you'll feel is quite a bit of tension through your upper back, through your neck. And as I said, you'll be restricting your motion. You may be limited because you can feel a bit of a tightness or a pinch point. Good. I'm gonna show you from the side as well. So from the side here, we're gonna have this, so this is a normal position, then I want you to tuck that chin back. So I'm gonna pull back and now I can feel it in that upper back. And we're rotating to the right and rotating to the left. Good. Rotating to the right and rotating to the left. And the goal here is with this is that control. So we're not actually having our neck go uncontrolled with its motion. So if you're a little vulnerable, if your neck is a bit tight, this is a perfect exercise to start with before you progress to some neck cars, okay? Try doing six to each way, but always you can sprinkle in more throughout the day.